of making money or showering or wiping yourself after using a toilet. You can focus on the important things. Do you travel, Amy? Well, I've been up in... There is a valuable exchange taking place on the roof of the Cherry Popper Ice Cream Company. Feel everyone involved. Steal the merchandise and take it to the helipad at the airport. There is a gate to your left that leads to the back of the factory.
Just in time, eh? Okie dokie, we him! Oh, shut up. Computers aren't evil. It's the people that program the computers that are evil. That's a pretty big difference. I'm talking to you through a computer right now. In fact, I am a computer. Well, anything that can think faster than me is evil. Anything which doesn't dance or sing or cry or wear a smile. You create your own reality. We are like the dust in the wind. We are golden. We've got to get ourselves back to the garden. Okay, okay. <gasps> Old maid, my mom calls her. Anyway, let's go to the phone. You're on KJet. Uh, yes, thank you, thank you. Yeah, that was great, really interesting. I, I, I'm, I'm British, you see. Like our ancient wood-wearing queen, Medusa. Me, 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 Medusa. Uh, 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 uh. Um, no, I, I think actually it was, it was Bodicea, but, but no, no, not, not really. I'm from Hampshire, you see. I'm, I'm here on business. A wanderer. Yes, I, I was wandering. Yes, a white witch. But you have a broom? Yes, it's ceremonial. Supposing I'd be a bad boy, like if I hadn't learned my spells or something, would, would, I, would I get smacked with it? Bill? Run! Run! Ah, wait! Never get a naked slave too close to one of Phil Cassidy's moonshine still. Shit, Phil. Did you uh, drink that stuff? Hell, you don't have to drink it. Just a good whiff will set you off. Wait. Listen, Phil, you said you could fix me up with some firepower. Sure thing. There's some Mexican gun runner been doing me for business of late. He does his weekly run about now. <clears throat> hey. Ram his hardware off the back of his trucks before he goes to ground. And you'd be doing me a favor while you're at it. Then finish him off. by the local hopscotch team. Hell no. BJ's Fit for Football, out now on Beta and VHS. Remember, to win a game of football or life, you have to annihilate everything in your path in a blind race. Ah! Yo, I said, what are you doing driving like that? for the stars, including me. And boys, have I got a chance. Hey. Next up is a living legend, a man who won the World Series single-handed, known to his fans as Death in tight pants, and known to his enemies as, oh my god, he got flattened by a truck. How is that fair? The sports legend, BJ Smith. So, BJ, welcome. Thanks. It's a real pleasure to be here. Oh, I know. But one thing's new. I never won the World Series. That's baseball. I played football. Yes, but it's all the same, isn't it? Football and baseball aren't the same. That's a wall with players who are degenerates, egomaniacs, and criminals. The other's football. Yes, but it's all the same. 
know what even hit is. Anyone can hit a home run. In baseball, you stand around the field, then violate your salary by 162, waiting for some action. Talk to a guy who just played an hour of football. He's been in the trenches getting Agent Orange sports drink poured all over his head to keep... We've got him surrounded. which helps make lives a lot less difficult for everybody. It's about sharing, sharing your taxes out amongst the select few. That's why I worked so hard at school, so I could reap the rewards now. Mm, I thought you worked hard at school because the other kids laughed at you and called you a square. That, that's a damn lie. They called me wet fart. They called me the bat because my voice didn't break until I was 19. So, Miss... Hey, Phil. How's it going? Hey, Tony! How you doing? This bit too long. I swear you should lay off that boom shine, man. It smells like paint stripper. It's make my eyes burn. Shh, 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 Tommy. Hey, come over here because there's something I want to show you. Something. Oof, God, should I be able to smell that from way over here? Don't boozy. you worry about Phil. the smell, Oof. Tommy. You just watch this. Shitty, cheap, bad bitch or something. There's some more on the bench. Ta-da! Oh, damn! <laughs> Or washing the car. That's what good is a leotard when you're washing the car? But put a man in a helmet and a cup, and he can wash the car in daily. That's fine. Watch out! Charlie the tree life. The best way to get your body fit is to have total disregard for your body. Every now and then, you wake up and come out of a concussion and say, Damn, I look good. Me who the roads made of jelly. Are you tired of your couches getting ruined? Oh, Grandpa. I made twinkles again. If you've got old people... Fuck a spoon. The mother of him. Yeah. You help bring back dignity. And we promise it will be the best three months of their... At the hospital, man. Too many cops in Viet Cong. There's an ex-army surgeon who owes me a few favors. And a lot more. He's got a place down in Little Havana. Oh, look. A giant fish. Vice City State of the Art Sanitation. Spoon, spoon. After they pass on to something better, guaranteed for three months or less, you can start enjoying their money. Finally, you can have quality family time again. Must be times. season? 
Hey, can I borrow a knife? A it deadly curse. A deranged killer. A small town in tears. Knife After Dark. Rated R for retarded. Ew, that's gross, BJ. Stop hitting on me. Hi, I'm Amy, and you're on KChat. So, what do you need to do for BJ's fit for football? Well, Angela, anybody can do it. What you need is a real expensive gym, a team of trainers, medical practitioners, dietitians, a big crowd, and a pony who wants you dead. Dead in the dirt. I mean, a nasty, blood-sucking leech of a man who will destroy you if you don't destroy him first. A man you like to set animals on. He's the enemy, and you sit in your foxhole till it's time just right, and then you pounce, baby, like a kitty cat on catnip. I'll sack a man, power drive him hard, again. Now, Miss Phil, I want to thank you for helping me out back there, son. Damn Charlie, he'll always ambush you somewhere or the other. Anyway, the wound is healing well, and it means I'll no longer be defrauding the government on my disability check.